some lights, new lights for the snake room. Like, it, it, next video, next video. Just wait. Aloha, top of the morning, friends and family. It's six in the morning. I wanted to bring you guys along for a whole day vlog because we haven't done that in a long time. This is ridiculous. Let's go inside where it's light. Yellow. One of the problems with uh, doing a whole day vlog is that you can't actually capture everything that happens in the day and put it on a video for people to watch because A, it wouldn't be very interesting. B, it's just too much. It's kind of like pick and choose your little moments. Which is what I've kind of done with this channel, is pick and choose little moments. I kind of want to let what happens, happens, just like I do with every day. I make plans. For example, today my plan is I'm going to let Leia lead the video because she really wanted to make a video. And so we're going to let her do that. I need to get a haircut because this mop is getting out of control. I need to go for a run. My buddy Matt is sleeping downstairs in the snake room with his dog. We're supposed to go on a run. We'll see how he's feeling after his long drive. Check these shoes out. This is what I run in generally these shoes right here. There's really nothing to them. It's like they're they're basically barefoot shoes and uh, And then look at my socks Keeps me from getting blisters and we need to film at least four episodes of my other channel the whiskey wimps where We do risky whiskey reviews because I'm going to participate in sober October I always have plans for every day to get things done You know obviously we're gonna work with the snakes like we do every day But I always leave myself open to the possibility that all the plans might change and everything might go a different direction. So I guess we'll just see how these plans fall through. <laughs> if they fall through or not. Hey dog. This light is disgusting in yellow because I didn't adjust the white balance on the camera. You guys wanna go watch the sunrise together? Yeah, I got tired of waiting for it. Well, look at this guy down here. Yeah, I, I live on the roof now. Are you ready for everything the day has to offer? No. no. The real question is, are we about to go for a run? <laughs> Sorry, I cut the sunrise short. I just saw Matt wake up on the other side on the security camera. So I was like, well, it's time to go for a run. So I need to change into something a little less, uh, you know. <gasps> oh, uh, that's a big jump for the morning. <laughs> All right, you guys gonna wake up the whole neighborhood. Let's get out of here. All right, we're gonna run. I'm not carrying the camera. See you guys when we get back. <laughs> Feels good to be running again after being sick. Whew, still got some snot rocket fuel though. <laughs> Starting back up where I was basically 35 miles a week. I'm planning to be running 20 miles straight without stopping before the Spartan race comes up in the middle of November. So I'm gonna keep increasing now I'm healthy again. More mileage every week. Let's see where Matt was. I wanna show you guys. Would you guys sleep here? Would you guys come and sleep right here in my snake room? Matt does it because uh, he doesn't want the dog's interactions to wake us up when he gets in late at night. So. That's why I make him a bed in here so he can do that, but he'll sleep in the house tonight. But yeah, would you sleep in my snake room? It's nice and humid as you can tell. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get showered up and then uh, see what that Tushi's up to. Cusco boys are all slicked up, looking nice, looking fresh. Oh, oh. All right, now we're really going to see what's up with that Tushi. We're definitely Tushi. not the only Cusco boys. We're coming, Tushi. We, we are Cusco boys. Yeah, but we're not the only ones. Yeah, we're not the only Cusco boys. Cusco's taking over the world. He said the Cusco boys. Hey, Noah. What? What do you know? I know. 
He said the Cusco boys. All right, Cusco boys. He said the. All right, Cusco. The Tushi Mushi Bushi Bushi Muka Muka Hakale. She has been asking me for like the entire week, can we please do a snake video down in the snake room, Daddy? Please, 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 please. So. We're doing it. I got a, a request from Redneck Trailer Trash, one of our wonderful subscribers down there in the comments, if we could do an update on our carpet python, our Morelia specifically, I think he asked, and our boas, which of we have two. Oh, the carpet one, we're gonna let it climb up here. Yeah, okay, well we better turn the fan off then. Ooh, and right before we show you these things, I wanna let you guys in on what is gonna be happening here on the channel in the near future. This. Friday morning, actually, I'm gonna be at the Reptarium this coming Friday morning as you're and watching. tomorrow we're going to go camping. <laughs> That's also true. We're busy. Uh, but yes, this- And he's going to give us a surprise. <laughs> I love surprises. Friday time! If you guys happen to be in the Michigan area and you want to come hang out at the Reptarium, it's not like an official hangout or anything, but that's I will be there. And I believe it's open to the public, right? You just have to like pay to come in or something like that. It's like a zoo, just like a regular zoo, right? So that's where I'm going to be if you want to come hang out. And then we're going to be at Tinley um, for the weekend right after that. So excited. Let's check out this, these snakes with uh, the Tushi Mushi May. Perfect. <laughs> Okay, maybe that thing's not a good idea. It's not very steep. That was my first time holding Holly. And unfortunately, Holly is uh, deep in shed. Of course, of course, the time we finally do an update on her, she's, she's just nice right now. The first boa constrictor we ever got, and that's Margie, the sun glow. <laughs> Last update snake is gonna be Loki, our boa constrictor occidentalis. How about a hand for a resident snake handler? <laughs> I think he wanted to go on me again. Oh, I'm sweaty. Yep, you need to take a shower. Oh, proud papa, that girl. Man, her story, multiple feeding response bites, just quelled her own fears and was just like, I, I'm not gonna let it stop me. Not gonna let it stop me. She's a champ, dude. <laughs> hey Matt, your dog's barking. <laughs> We're going to In-N-Out. I know that all you folks that wish you were going to In-N-Out, 
probably not some there, you know there's this weird animosity against in and out from people that are aren't in and out in and out yeah in and out it's like this like some a lot there's a lot of people out there apparently that think that Chick-fil-A is a lot better than in and out are it's, you one of those no it's two different things you can't compare in and out to Chick-fil-A okay well how we, chicken and burger i feel like people that don't like in and out are the ones that don't know about the secret menu and aren't able to, don't know how to like customize it to exactly how they like it I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong about that. I don't know. If you if you've had in and out, did you think that it wasn't that impressive? And if that was the case, did you not order off the secret menu? As I mentioned this morning, we're filming many episodes of the. Where are you going? That way. Uh, yeah, that way or straight now. I set this thing. I, I set that that if we don't hit a thousand subscribers by the end of the year on the Whiskey Wimps, then I don't know what. I don't know what. I don't know exactly what. Yeah, I know it's a big lip issue. <laughs> But, the, you know, the reason being, as you know, I've got a fourth kid coming. I'm going to be exponentially busy. I might become a youth pastor. Like, there's all this stuff coming out. We, we'll still hang out and do stuff if that's the best. Case. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. I was considering, like, asking for a bump from this channel to the Whiskey Wimps. However, however, I, I did pushed it pretty hard on this channel when we first started it. And we did get a little nice initial bump of subscribers. But I feel like there's a lot of folks that just subscribe because they like this channel and then they don't ever watch it. And that ends up hurting the, that channel because we have a bunch of subscribers that don't watch. So what I'm gonna say is that if you have any interest at all in learning a little bit more about the amazing thing that is whiskey, then go go subscribe to that channel. Go do, or go watch it first, check it out, see if it's something you think you'll like. And then if it is something you like, then subscribe. But don't subscribe if you're not gonna watch it. That's all I ask. Or if you're a fan of me, you should subscribe then. I don't know if you remember the last uncut we did when we pushed the whiskey wimps. A lot of people said uh, they weren't a fan of you. I think that you would have had a little bit much to drink that point. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> So it's a pretty cool setup once it's all worked out. Those of you who watched the Whiskey Wimps channel seen the set, but I'm gonna take a break from setting it up because it's got a bit more to go and it's pretty toasty out here. So I need to edit this video because we got four more episodes to shoot today. So I, I won't have time to do everything if I don't edit this video right now. So I'm gonna say goodbye to you guys. Thank you for watching. And I just wanna say I'm really, uh, inspired again to do more vlog style videos kind of like we used to do back in the day where you just come along for the whole day and checking out what's happening if you guys enjoy that uh, leave a comment down below if you don't enjoy it let me know why and we'll see you on the next video you guys take care of yourselves take care of each other we'll see you on the next one aloha this little piggy went to market this little piggy stayed home this little piggy had roast beef. This little piggy had none. But this little piggy won. Wee 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 w